Yes, we're back. We're back in train sim. We're going to try uh, try something new for this uh, quick little journey. So grab your whistle and let's go. So hi there, Steve here, and welcome back to train sim. Well, 17, I think we're still calling it. Yeah, quick little journey for this one. Um, thought we'd try something we haven't tried before in the career mode. Um, we've done the... Uh, where are we? Done the first one of the Summering Barn. We're obviously working our way through uh, South Wales. The next one we'll try on that one is Cheltenham Spa to Maystag. So let's go back and look at some of the other ones that we haven't, uh, haven't done yet. We could do Hoboken. In fact, yeah, uh, this is another one we can do. New York to New Haven. I uh, didn't like that one. Um, signal tutorial. They're a bit long. Yeah, let's do something American then. Let's do the Hoboken. So if you're new to my videos, as always, welcome. There's something from OMSI, the bus simulator, on a Monday, Wednesday and Saturday. Something from Fernbus, the coach simulator, on a Friday. Something like this from trains, normally on a Tuesday, although we have popped something up a little bit short like this on the last couple of Sundays. And something from flight on a Thursday. So plenty of content from me. So hit that subscribe button if you're enjoying watching it. Leave a comment below. And yeah, we'll um, see how we go. So far, train sim does seem to be popular on the channel. So for those of you that are watching, thank you very much. And that is something I might have to purchase, I think. Class 158 DMU. Yeah. And that is uh, coming. Train Sim World. Uh, I'll have access to the, uh, the beta in, in December. So we'll certainly give that a look. So I purchased the uh, Pioneers Edition, so I get the beta access. you still got to repurchase the game, though. Um, so when Train Sim World does come out, next year. I've still got to repurchase it. Okay. So here we are then. Good afternoon, engineer. Starting here at Hoboken, the scenario will take you straight through to Newark Penn on the first part of a run down to Bayhead. Before you start off, open the doors to allow the passengers to board. So there we are. You've gone a bit electric with this one then. So the Simmering Barn electric train did look quite good. This actually does look uh, does look quite good as well. But we'll see how it goes when we actually go to move off. So we'll jump back inside for now. Track IR is working. But we'll, uh, we'll reset it. There we go. So put the reverse room forward and get ourselves ready to go. Oh yes, we're moving, hooray! It's a 50 mile an hour speed limit. tracks there. So I don't know how the American signaling system works so uh, this could be a challenge. So there's only a short one for this. So normally trains Tuesday but I uh, thought I'd pop something up uh, for today as well. Sound quite good. Good, you got that buzz of the uh, electric cables. Okay, we're actually speeding up. Okay. 
uh, yeah, um, normally the channel was um, OMSI focused or has been, uh, but since I put the first uh, train sim video up, um, which although it was as glitchy as anything, um, it's got a lot of views. Um, the last couple I've put up have been fairly popular as well. So um, yeah, I'm actually toying with doing a bit more train sim on the channel. But the question is where to fit it in. If you are enjoying these videos, then yeah, leave a comment if you want to see more of them. Please let me know uh, in the comment section. Obviously hit that subscribe button if you want to see more. I do like a diesel. Could be okay on this sort of journey. It does look um, fairly well modelled in here. Okay, at this speed it might take us a while. <laughs> to get to where we are. But here we come nonetheless. We're passing through the original Morris and Essex Railway Tunnel under the Bergen Hill built in 1876. Parallel tunnel to the left was built by Delaware, Lackenauer and Western Railroad in 1908. Of course the Americans haven't got anything really old, have they? Now, see this distance thing doesn't seem to be working. It says we can arrive at Newark Penn Track 4 in 1.3 miles. 1.53 miles, which it seems to have been. The start. I actually think this is um, the journey that I've tried previously, and this is the one where I lost a lot of points because the speed limits were wrong. So we'll take it steady under here. Do expect an epic fail coming up. I'll take us down here. This is 1.53 miles. That hasn't changed. tunnel. Uh, being cautious with the speed. I've got a horrible feeling that it is going to drop any time now. says 75 coming up. It does seem as though I've still got green lights, but that's a good thing. Well, that bottom one was red. Yes, I don't know how the American system works. Speed limit in the, uh, the tunnel is understandable. But you would have that. Turn that 
terrain does look quite good scenery wise people inside all set facing backwards Cautious with the speed. I don't trust that that's actually going to be 75. So I don't actually know how far away we are. across the river. It's about, yeah, electrics are good, but I do prefer the sound of a diesel. Oh, train coming the other way. See, that's the sort of car I want to drive, the train I want to drive. Is that one coming towards us? That's the same as this, though. Okay, I thought he's coming towards us. He's not. He's stopped. Okay, so we've got 75. Let's give it the beans. is coming up, which from memory it wasn't 50. I'm going to stick it at 40. So they've got a separate braking system, they can actually use that as a brake. I think it's as effective as a brake will be. So yeah, I'm going to play cautious here. CSX South County Yards on the left and we shortly be heading into the Western Waterfront Connection. This track was opened in 1991 to allow trains to pass from the original Pennsylvania Railroad to the Delaware, Lackanawa and Western Railroad lines from Hoboken. So it's a fairly recent line then. Unusual. Uh, well, I suppose they've got space in America, but for me being in the UK, it's unusual to open a new train line. So we got to um, one going all across London, cross rail, whatever it's called. See, I'm still. Although that says 50, I don't trust it. So I'm going to slow it down. Do you know how much electricity this thing consumes? You see, 45. If that said 50, it's actually 45. So I was right to keep it slow. And that now says 60. I suppose now. I don't know where our endpoint is. It can't be that far away. Something's broken on that information system. Actually, quite a 
Frosty Great in that. A bit of a climb. coming up. Which again, I don't trust that that's a 45, so I'm going to slow it down to about 35. Authority Trans Hudson Path Depot. We'll shortly be leaving the shared trackage and crossing over the main northeast corridor lines as we head into Newark Station over the Passiac River on the Docklift Bridge. Okay. Okay, I'm going to keep it to about 35. I'll stay with the in cab view, I think, as well. Just to be on the safe side. Actually, no, 1.12. It's not. We're actually on track now. It was 45. Okay. The next one's a 30. This should be a 30 now, it really isn't going to troll me, no, that's fine. Oh, so this is the bridge it's on about, is this a lifter bridge? I'm guessing it doesn't lift anymore. And we're at pen track 4. stopping uh, too early. There we go. We have arrived at Newark Penn Station. Obviously having never been there, I don't know if it looks anything like this. It's 
quite an uneventful journey that was, I think. So in the next video though, we'll get back into a bit of diesel. There we go, that concludes the introductory scenario. Let's see how I did. Indeed. I did okay, 974 XP, which was me 14,232, level 13 and a half. Job done. There we go then. That's that one done. Next time, back into some good old diesel on the Wales run. Um, but we will carry on with this uh, in the future. Don't forget to hit that like button, um, subscribe to see more videos, leave a comment below if you're enjoying this train sim series and if you've got any suggestions for any. Uh, any routes and trains. Um, until the next time then, if you have been, thanks very much for watching.